Hey, I'm Patrick. Hey, I'm Steven. We're the National Film Society. Today we're talking about awesome Asian bad guys. There's a long and storied history of awesome Asian bad guys in cinema. You have films like Black Rain, Rising Sun, Karate Kid 2, and of course, Platoon. This guy, he was in all the awesome 80s action movies. Like what? Like Die Hard. Yeah, Die Hard. He was in everything. He could fight with his hands, with swords, with machine guns, and he had this really cool mustache, which is actually the reason why I have a mustache today. Anyway, all these guys were awesome. And they were Asian. And they were? Bad guys. Are you guys the American movie group? National Film Society? Yeah, 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 yeah. The asexual movie geeks who ramble on and on and on about movies. And Ryan Gosling. Who are you? Tamlin. Tamlin Tamita. You might know me from Karate Kid 2, Joe That Club. You might have seen me on Glee. Oh my God, Harry Shum Jr.'s mom? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. I just saw your video on Awesome Asian Bad Guys and I need your help. What? We just shot it. Right now, we haven't even uploaded it. Let's hear her out. Thank you. I need your help to assemble Awesome Asian Bad Guys. Steven, whose car is on our lawn? Steven, help me out. I go to work all day and all you do is play around with that hippie. Oh my God, is he married? No one can know that I'm here. Why do you need the Awesome Asian Bad Guys? Just meet me here. Please. I don't want to catch him jerking off in our house again. Harry Shum Jr.'s mom, you gotta get your car off the lawn. Okay. Fuck! The seat taken? Shoes? Oh. Yeah. Steven couldn't make it. Ow. Ow. Sorry. Dude, wait to wait up for me. So why do you need us to assemble the awesome Asian bad guys? Does he look familiar? He the Asian Charlie Brown? <laughs> Aaron Takahashi, the commercial actor? Seriously? You know him and not me? Aaron is a member of the most ruthless Asian gang, the Wang Chung. You could say he's their leader, spreading filth, crime, and STDs all over Los Angeles. And he's also my sister's killer. My twin sister, Pamlin. Aaron needs to be dealt with. And the only people capable of doing that are the awesome Asian bad guys. Why, why not white bad guys? She seems to like to do that. Fools! Blood sport, big trouble in little China, the fast and the furious Tokyo drift, always playing second fiddle to the white guy. You want to keep perpetuating that? And if you scratch my back, I'll be on mine. Help me, Asian movie boys. National Film Society, have a sticker. Help me, National Film Society. You're my only hope. This reminds me a lot of the A-Team. Which episode? All of them. Girls, buckle down. Or you can kiss Harvard goodbye and say hello to San Francisco State. You're late. Take off your shoes. I went to San Francisco State. Okay, I got a bunch of leads on the awesome Asian bad guys. About that. I'm thinking I'm out. 
What are you talking about? I don't know if you've noticed, but I've got other responsibilities. Harry Shum Jr.'s mom isn't even paying us. Dude, she offered us 200 bucks. That's 100 dollars each. Still, I mean, identical twin sister named Pamlin? Yeah, twin sisters. I gotta find a real job. I've got two kids, Grace works all day busting her butt, and all we do is make videos. But we're artists, it's the process. Look at how far we've come. We've got a chance. Don't you realize we've never accomplished anything? Your wife, your kids, that girl I met who may or may not be underage, they had to do what's right for them because it's their time, their time. But down here, it's our time, our time. And that's all over the second we'd ride up Troy's bucket. That makes no sense. But Patrick, you goonie, I'm in. Get off the chair. What's it say? I could have made your car explode or cut your brake line, but I don't know how to do those things. You have been warned. I know who we should get first. Al Leong. Man, he was in MacGyver? Riptide? A-Team? Magnum P.I.? Simon and Simon? Mr. Leung, we need your help. With your taxes? No, with kicking ass. You got the wrong guy. Al, can I call you Al? No, you can't call me Al. Al, I just want you to know that I've admired your work for some time. Lethal Weapon, Die Hard, Big Trouble in Little China, Goddamn Genghis Khan and Bill and Ted's. I've watched every badass thing you did. In some ways, you could say that you're my idol. I even grew my mustache to be just like you. Let's go. Those movies were 20 years ago. Even if you wanted to, I doubt this guy has what it takes to be part of Awesome Asian Bad Guys. You don't think I have what it takes to be an Awesome Asian Bad Guy? Well, you watch this. Oh, 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 oh shit! Oh, Jesus. Oh, Holy God. shit! Oh. Holy oh. shit! And I'm all right. I've been shot with AK-47s, blown up in a helicopter. Actually, I've been blown up in two helicopters. And Mel Gibson broke my neck with his legs. And my talent? I can't be killed. Does this mean you're in? And that you'll train us? I've never gotten a badass movie catchphrase. Promise me that I'll get mine, and I'm in. Then you get this hippie to shave off that wannabe Aldi Young mustache. Who's next? Jet Li. But he's a good guy. Not Lethal Weapon 4. And Mummy 3. Are you sure this is where Jet Li lives? That's what the old naked guy in the gym says. Should we bring Al? Nah. The guy's all tuckered out. God damn, that Fu Manchu is sexy as hell. So what do you think about me and Tamlin? I think we're gonna have sex. Hey champ, your dad home? It's probably him. Oh. Hey, yo. Hey buddy, you all right? What are you doing in my driveway? You're not Jet Li. You're George Chung. Rambo 2 blew you up with an exploding tip arrow. He was also an airwolf? Fall guy? Magnum PI? TJ Hooker? Simon and Simon? Yeah, 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 yeah. What you want with my kid? What the hell? Well, now nobody wins, you spaz. 
Your kid's name Jet Li? I made a deal with my now ex-wife that she could name our firstborn. She said she would name it after her favorite movie star. Wait, but your movies. I loved you in Starsky and Hutch and Rush Hour. Someone get this kid some Ritalin. Ah! 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 Uh, hey, I'm sorry, I, I can't join the awesome Asian bad guys. You know, my fighting days are over. I'm a freaking pacifist now. Oh! Ah! What did I tell you, Jet? Martial arts is only for defense. Holy shit. Exploding tip arrow guy? You're joining the awesome Asian bad guys? I'm not, but Jet will. Jet needs to learn discipline. Jet. Have fun with these guys. I'll see you later. Okay. Really? You just got beat up by a girl. I can't believe you wouldn't let me eat this. Dude, no eating in the car. Someone's been following us. Hey. Hello. Uh, so I hear you're assembling the awesome Asian bad guys. <laughs> I'm Randall. Randall Park. I was in Larry Crown, Dinner for Schmucks. <laughs> oh, come on. You guys got to give those movies a chance. They're great. <laughs> anyway, I think I'd make a perfect member of the awesome Asian bad guys, and I want in. Have you ever played an Asian bad guy? Well, actually, that's why I'm here. My agent says I have to stop playing these nice, emasculated, neutered characters. I can be bad. Actually, it was me who broke into your car last night. That was you? Yeah. That wasn't bad. That was harmless. We'll let you know when we assemble the harmless agent bad guys. <laughs> How's that for harmless? <laughs> You're so dead. Oh, no. Get back or I kill her! It's the bad guy from Karate Kid 2. Hey, nipple dick. I was also the drag racer from Better Off Dead. I want, I want my two dollars. Plus he was in Murder, She Wrote? Hunter? TJ Hooker? Walker, Texas Ranger? Simon and Simon? Is somebody gonna help me? Ah! 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 Dead. Hey, I'm surprised this still worked. My mom gave me this like a year ago. Oh, relax. The safety's on, see? Oh my gosh, okay. Oh, now it's on. Jesus. Tamlin, I was about to save you. This was a test. This is Yuji Okamoto. I figured you guys might need my help. Where's James Hong? Where's Bolo? All you got me was Al Leong and what, some kid? Her name is Jet Li. And her dad is George Chung. Out of all the awesome Asian bad guys, all you got me was some dentist? Well, actually, I'm an actor. I was in a movie called Larry Crown and uh, Dinner for Schmucks. No, no one's, one's seen, seen those movies. movies. Jesus Christ. Sweetie, Randall's not really part of the team. He's just been stalking us. Well, considering he's the only one who tried to save me, he is now part of awesome Asian bad guys. What? Yes. So this is the team. Stay <sighs> I almost had you. Take off your shoes. All right, I went to City Hall and found information on Aaron Takahashi. What Tamlin says seems to be true. He runs the Wang Chung out of a studio apartment above a compound in Little Tokyo. Baller. Stop! No one do a fucking thing! Now, open the door. Bend down. The compound's heavily guarded. Aaron's protected at all times. Slip him, slip him! Aaron's got one main bodyguard. He's big, he's bad, he's Dante Bosco. Rufio? Rufio! <laughs> he hates to be called that. I hate to be called that. I'm 
glad you've embraced this mission. When I commit to something, I give it 100%. But when the mission's over, I'm done. Yeah, with awesome Asian bad guys. And the National Film Society. What? Are you serious? I am. I promised my wife I'm getting a real job. With health insurance? Our one best shot to get Aaron is this weekend in his first annual talent show. How are we going to get past the guards? I haven't figured that out yet. Where are we going to park? Come on, let's round up the Abagas. Who? Abagas? A-A-B-G. Awesome Asian bad guys? Yeah, that's not going to catch on. Hey, I brought kimchi for everyone, except him. Hey, where are my kids? Your old lady came home. Hey, honey. Did you eat? She's your wife? Yeah, she's the love of my life. Shame what pumping out two kids did to her, though. Her breasts got bigger, my thighs didn't. Now all she wants to do is make more. Are you serious? Because I would love to have sexual intercourse with your wife. Sorry. Hey, Jet, you have a great gift, but you got to learn to control your anger. You don't want to end up like me. Hey, George, check it out. Morons. Jet. Is that urine? Jet. You're astute, but what? My kimchi. Maybe trouble looking for you. The one-liners need some work. Like, I'll take my coat back now, asshole. Or, you go in pieces, asshole. <laughs> oh, uh, I've been using this new hand lotion. It has jojoba oil in it. <laughs> Is it jojoba or jojoba? But whatever you call it, it's magical. <laughs> what the? Uh, let's see if shit floats. <laughs> I'm all right. What gives? Where's Tamlin? Tamlin had an audition. She put me in charge of training you useless pukes. I'm training them. Not anymore, old man. The hand drum that taught Daniel LaRusso in five seconds how to defeat me. The hand drum that shamed me from my village for the rest of my life. That very one. That's cool that you want to train us, but Al's going to train us too. But you have to be nice. And if you're nice, this 20 cent piece of balsa wood is all yours. OK. We'll need to plan the precise time to attack Aaron. We already figured it out this weekend. At his talent show. Well, then I have that much time to get you ready. To get you mad, to get you that look, the eye of the tiger. Sure, whatever, chump stain. Talent show's tomorrow. I feel like we should get ready. Should we work out? Oh. Been a while. These things are impossible. Butt munches. None of you have what it takes. Hey, what do you think about me wearing this for the talent show? How fast was that? You said I couldn't make a pompadour out of pubes. <laughs> and maybe we need some alternative training. Like my kind of training. Rufio, my wig likes you. Faster, 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 faster. Ah, oh no! Bro, what the hell are you thinking of fucking doing? Rufio. <laughs> How do you put up with that? Aaron and I used to be tight, like brothers, until I betrayed him. He was everyone's first choice.
to play Rufio in Hook. Until I told Spielberg that he thought Goonies was a piece of shit. I got the role. Aaron got kicked off the set. Until Aaron says otherwise. I'm forever to this debt. And I will always hide my face in shame. You've more than made it up to him. You don't owe him anything anymore. Spielberg. This the guy who is going to train you? <laughs> Ow! Ow! Yourself. Ow! Yourself. Ah. Why don't you like me? Because you're better than me. Is that what you want to hear? Hey, guys! Watch this! This is never going to work. Everything's going to be fine. I heard this is exactly how things were on the set of Iron Eagle. It's awesome. It's called camouflage, Dorkwad. Yeah, Dorkwad. Where's Steve? Said he doesn't want to be part of the awesome Asian bad guys anymore. Douche nozzle. I'll talk to him. Keep training. Dude, check it out. Badass, huh? What's wrong with you? You OK? Yeah. Why wouldn't I be OK? Because whenever something's bothering you, you knit. Come on, everyone's outside. You're scaring me. I did some more snooping around. I couldn't find any record of any Palantamita or a single evil thing that Aaron's done. Unless you count him having a profile on J-Date. Dude, that doesn't mean anything. He's an underworld crime boss. Of course you're not going to find anything on him online. He's a shadow, a ghost. Ooh, his favorite movie, La Bamba. Richie! We've got no skills, no training. She's not even paying us. Dude, $200. We don't even know how we're going to get inside Aaron's impenetrable fortress. Look, what's in it for us? For the NFS? I thought you were quitting National Film Society. I am quitting the National Film Society. Come on, Steve. We're doing this for all the people who couldn't stand up for themselves. I even stopped drinking for today. You act like you're doing this to find some sort of meaning in your life? We all know it's just so you can get down Harry Shum Jr.'s mom's pants. Fine, then. We don't need you. You were just doing this to prove your worth to your suffocating wife. You're pretty good. I know. My property. Hey, hey, watch it. What? Ah! What's in it for us? For the NFS? I thought you were quitting National Film Society. I am quitting the National Film Society. To the National Film Society. To the National Film Society. Yes! Fine then, we don't need you. You were just doing this to prove your worth to your suffocating wife. Grace? Steven. Why aren't you at work? Uh, are, are you cheating on me? Steven, I'm not cheating on you. Then what are you, what are you doing here? I took the afternoon off. You're the one who spends all your time with Patrick and those old Asian guys. 
And remember to get the good boba tea, idiot. Yeah. You think they name boba tea after Boba Fett or the other way around? You work all the time. I'm home with the kids. I, I'm a good dad. You are a good father. But what I need, what our family needs, is a good husband. You're right. I know what I need. I need you. I love you. I love you, Stephen. Just so you know, I quit awesome Asian bad guys today. Oh, good. But what about your promise to Harry Shum Jr.'s mom? What about the $200? I only get half. Oh. Besides, I, I haven't seen her in days. Holy shit. Tamlin. Tamlin? She's alive. She's alive? You told me you took care of her. Kill her. Isn't that her? Hey, hey, Tamlin, just so you know, I'm quitting awesome Asian bad guys. Oh, shit. Uh, Aaron, I, I missed. Run, you dumbass. How is she? She's live, and she's doing well. But she's had to undergo massive reconstructive plastic surgery. As her husband, you may want to steady yourself. Actually, I'm the husband. You're the husband. <laughs> We're ready to take off the bandages. But be prepared. Grace may not be exactly as you remember her, physically. Doesn't matter, Doc. I love my wife. We had to take the fat from her breasts to graft onto her face and other sections that were damaged. Why, you are a cruel and merciless god! <laughs> we'll give you guys some space, sir. Doc. Sir. Steven? I'm here, honey. It's gonna be all right, sweetheart. I want you to finish what you started. You and that idiot hippie must lead the awesome Asian bad guys and complete your mission. Why the change of heart? You gave that Asian lady your word. And my husband and baby daddy always keeps his word. But what if we die? What if you don't? Sorry, I just wanted to make sure. Yeah, okay. <laughs> I appreciate your concern for my wife. Whatever. Where is everybody? They all quit. Richie. Steven. I heard about your wife. I'm sorry. She's gonna be all right. What do you fucking do? You're right. We shouldn't be on this mission. Aaron hasn't done a thing. Agent Charlie Brown had Dante shoot my wife. Does this mean you're back? Yeah. The awesome Asian bad guys quit. Why should we give you another chance? You guys are our idols. Growing up, we watched every badass thing you did and you never got your due. We never wanted to be doctors, lawyers, or firemen. We wanted to be awesome Asian bad guys. When everyone else forgot about us, when we resigned to be faceless, when we were content to just fade away, they sought us out. We meant something to them. We need them as much as they need us. So you guys back in? On one condition. I thought I was gonna shave it all off, but that's much worse. All right, it's enough fun and games with Mr. Monopoly over here, but we still don't even have a way into errands. What are those? There's no time to explain. Actually, there is. These are called invitations, and they'll get me and you in. Turns out they think National Film Society's talented. You are now all ready. No. We are now ready. Cool, crossbow. Hello, 
Hamlin. Give me one good reason why I shouldn't kill you now. I'll give you two. One, you're not a killer. And two... And two... Christ, Rufio, what took you so long? Please don't call me that. So, Tamlin, here by yourself? No, Aaron. You sure like wearing dresses, don't you? It's a formal gown. I've assembled the world's baddest crew to bring you down. Say hello to the awesome Asian bad guys. What time are we supposed to be at errands? Six. Uh, it's only 5.05. We still got plenty of time. Hey, Steven, before you leave, can you reset the clocks in the house? I forgot last night was daylight savings. <laughs> it's spring forward, fall back, right? Uh-oh. Looks like you put your trust in the wrong people. Take a seat. Not there. Uh, 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 uh. Uncomfortable, right? Actually, no. They're pretty comfy. Helps your back, tightens your ass, but you wouldn't know that. Oh my god, that's why you wear a dress. Enough! They are uncomfortable. And now you know how I feel. Going from audition to audition, learning there's only one role, maybe, for an Asian actor. And then losing that role to you. And I thought I took care of all of that by having you killed. You didn't kill me. Obviously. You killed my twin sister, Hamlin. Hamlin? Is that even a name, Rufio? When I had you, or who I thought was you killed, I still wasn't booking that one role. I kept getting passed over and over and over. Oh my God, that talent show. It isn't to showcase new talent, is it? Ding, 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 ding. Give that lady a fortune cookie. I gathered all the Asian American talent that I could find so I could get them together. So you could kill them. So you wouldn't have any more competition. Excuse me, sir. Guests are arriving. I'll be there in a moment. And uh, people from your J-Day group. In a moment? Tie her up. I'll deal with her later. Why don't we just kill her? I have a perfectly good gun. Won't pull the trigger and pow. I mean, half a second, maybe less. Just do what I say, Rufio. Hmm. Shit, they got Tamlin. Are you sure? Yeah, there's a frowny face emoticon. Okay, plans changed, but mission stays the same. Uh, Steven and Patrick, uh, you got the invites. I'll scale around the back. Uh, Jed has a candy bars. Right here. Well, can I have one? No! no! Al stays in the car, ready for when we bail. No way, it's my turn to give a badass movie catchphrase. <sighs> It'll be all right. Let's go. What? Where, where are the guns? Where are the grenades? Where's the crossbow? I thought you were grabbing them. I thought you were grabbing them. Ass clouds. I'm really excited to be a judge on this talent show. Yeah, so am I. Who are these pretty people who said they could be judges? They're online creatives. Where the hell are we? You are nowhere. You said you wanted the talented Asians. They have over half a billion views. Any of you ever do a commercial for Amp Mobile? Have you guys ever heard that? <laughs> yeah, didn't think so. Uh, hey, we're not gonna start soon, right? I'll start when I wanna start. Well, Wes and Ted are still in the bathroom. Wes and Ted, too, big. Really? You need all of it? Like you need it. Just use water. Why do you have a douchey mustache? Why don't you? 
All right, go on in. Good evening, sir. I come from a rough area. I used to be addicted to crack, but now I'm off it. That's why I am selling candy bars. Would you please buy some so I can stay off the rock? Go away, kid. If chocolate's not your thing, I also have a great selection of magazine subscriptions. I said go away. Ah! Did you just hit a little girl? What? No! She's addicted to crystal meth. I'm reporting you. Oh, please don't! Oh, wait, I, I thought she said crack. She's addicted to crack and crystal meth and all the other drugs. I need to take her inside. Come on. Hippie love bullshit. I'm gonna go find Tamlin. Stick to the mission. Love has its own mission. Really? Love has its own mission? Damn it, Patrick! Oh man, that was awesome work, Jet. I mean, you really sold it, especially with the blood work. You know, I actually did blood work once on an episode of CSI. I think I did pretty good myself, actually. What the hell? What? What's going on? Let me go. That for not believing in Patrick. Patrick? Who cares about Patrick? He's a loser, a slacker. He's a little piece of turd that you can't wipe off. Only like my little loose turd. Ha! Jet! You're a sneaky old bastard. <laughs> Honk? Jet! Talent? Just watch. Where's Patrick? He went after Tamlin. Where's Randall? Jet! We need to get closer to Aaron. How is that even possible? I think I know a way. <gasps> Damn. Oh my god. On time, you idiot. Oh, right. I don't think we need to look any further. We found our million dollar winner. I, Aaron Takahashi Berg, am extremely impressed. Now, since no one can beat C. Diddy, and quite frankly, since everyone is already here, I'm just going to- We can beat him. Everyone's already in the auditorium. We should go. I want to see who wins. No, 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 no. Aaron's going to kill them all. There is no winner. Why are you dressed like that? And what's with that hipster mustache? My idol did this to me. Isn't this cute? I told Aaron this would happen if I tied you up, didn't I? She was there. She could back me up. Do it, Rufio. That's Rufio? Jet! So, Mr. 80s fashion, your group's talent? Uh, same as the other guy. Air guitar. Just follow me. Trying to mock me? Are we gonna die? Me? I can't die. You? Probably. Get off my stage! Not so fast! They're here with her. They're here to kill you.
So this is the team assembled to kill little old me. Some guy stuck in the 80s. A little girl. An old man. Lou Diamond Phillips. A ghost. and a dweeb hipster with an awful mustache. What, like you guys are Asian bad guys? Or Abagas? <laughs> Abagas? <laughs> no, we are awesome. Asian. Bad. Guys. Dad. Jesus, they keep multiplying. George, I thought you were a pacifist. Pacifist, my hands. No one messes with my daughter. Or the awesome Asian bad guys. Let's roll! Get up! I got two guns. You keep for your correction. I know you like it. anything anymore. Get him. I love you too. Go get him! Oh crap, okay. We should take off our shoes first. Oh my god. Give it up, Aaron. You're through. Yes! Oh. You! But I saw you die! Why can't any of you die? Stick around! Damn, my catchphrase! I screwed it up! Oh. oh. Hope we're not too late. Nah, they wouldn't start without us. Oh. Oh. 
We did it! And we're still alive! Yeah! Ah. And the National Film Society is gonna keep going strong! Yeah! Yes, 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 yes. And I'm gonna have sex! Yeah! yeah. It's just a tattoo. Who are you? You found me out. I'm not Tamlin. Erin Takahashi did kill her. I'm her twin sister, Pamlin. I've always lived under the shadow of my sister. So much so that I erased all evidence of my existence and moved to Long Beach 20 years ago. Long Beach is far. I came back to LA a month ago, hoping to reconcile in a remote part of town with no cell phone reception. I hope I don't have to use my cell phone. A message from Aaron Takahashi, a.k.a. Aaron Takahashiberg. They never saw me. And I vowed to avenge her. That's the most bad shit crazy thing I've ever heard. But it all adds up. Patrick! 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 Patrick. Hey, buddy. We brought kimchi. <laughs> no hard feelings about the mustache? No. I can never stay mad at my idol. <laughs> You're one twisted fuck. Damn it. That's what I should have said. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I should have said. <laughs> Earlier today, 88 people were found gunned down, strangled, and will every single kind of murder. This bloodbath all took place after an illegal talent show. It was the awesome Asian bad guys. They did this. We will find them. There you have it, folks. The awesome Asian bad guys. They are considered armed and dangerous. They are wanted by the law fugitives. Whatever, oh, yeah, numb nuts. <laughs> To be continued. continued.